Hello, Miss Connor. Did you get the test results, Doc? Yes. Miss Connor, your child is in perfect health. She's sleeping soundly next door. You'll be able to take her home this afternoon. Oh. Although there was something that we noticed during the examination that I feel just in the interest of full disclosure, I should let you know. What is it? Miss Connor, your baby is an old soul. What? What, what does that mean? Not a lot. Is it some sort of physical impairment? No, no. It's, it's more of a personality thing, really. We noticed looking into her eyes that she has a telltale, far away stare, like she's carrying the secrets of the world on her shoulders. She'll probably take an early interest in the works of Emily Dickinson and engage in an old-fashioned dyeing hobby like knitting or stamp collecting and insist that she finds it invigorating. These are all symptoms of an old soul. Is it going to affect her going through school? Um, no, she, she may have some difficulties early on in her friendships. She's likely to get along better with her friend's parents, but I'm sure in time she'll adjust. Well, is there anything that I should do? I'm afraid there isn't much. This affliction is generally harmless. What I would re recommend, however, is that you keep an eye on her behaviour. Um, we had a patient in here, a 17-year-old, who was an old soul, and instead of learning to drive on her parents' vehicle, she insisted on riding a vintage bicycle everywhere she went. She was run down on the highway. Oh, she's still alive, but very badly hurt. You can't let your child's personality quirks result in the pursuit of antiquated, dangerously inconvenient practices from eras gone by. I would encourage her to channel her whimsy into, I don't know, a, a blog or a market stall. Well, I'll definitely encourage that. Doc, thank you so much for all the advice. She's my sweet baby angel. I'll love her no matter what. Of course. <laughs> Congratulations, Miss Connor. <laughs> Oh god, I totally forgot to mention. She's allergic to peanuts. <laughs> Don't let her go eating any handmade nut butters. <laughs> Seriously, don't let her near peanuts. She will die. She's fatally allergic. Don't. That's all. <laughs> Thanks for coming in. Bye.